Hey, hey, hey guys, Safi here, or aka Curly Fit Gamer. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another part of Assassin's Creed Valhalla. <laughs> Hope you guys are all doing well. Hope you guys are all staying safe, loving one another, because you know this is what it's all about at the end of the day. It is Sunday, guys. Um, I'm all alone in the house, so I figured I might as well just get as much recording as I possibly can. In the morning, though, it did take me a little bit to actually get up on here. I meant to actually get on here at 6 a.m. in the morning, um, but it was a little hard for me to get up. So, it's like in the afternoon, like 1 o'clock. So, what have I been doing for literally the past 6 hours? Well, let me tell you. So, <laughs> there's this game that apparently has been out for a while called At Dead of Night. And I'm not going to play that junk. I mean, I'll probably watch someone play it. I mean, I don't know. I'll probably play it. It may be recorded. I don't know, but then I have a I don't have a webcam, and I feel like games like that. Well, anyway, let me just get to the bottom of the store, and then I'll do my commentary about it afterwards. So, um, why does this take so long to load? I'm like super confused. Okay, <laughs> that was weird. Okay, so anywho, what's the meaning of this? How did you like the taste of battle? That was. Exhilarating! Reminds me of my younger days. Had you not delayed those reinforcements, we might never have succeeded. You are brave for a priest. Do not underestimate the faithful. We give our lives to a god we cannot see or touch. There is no greater bravery than that. Mm. Yeah, it takes a lot of faith. You look pleased with yourself. Smell that air. Smells like victory. Smells like blood and brains and the soiled underclothes of dead men. Aye. Isn't that what victory smells like? Perhaps to you, our stick. I'll take roasting meat, warm meat, and a fire. Ah, you always were soft. Get on with you. Uh. Duvena. I'm glad to see you made it through. Be proud, Eivor. You found Sigurd against the odds. I found his shadow. I must hope that the scars Fulke has inflicted on his mind will heal. Sigurd is strong. He will take more than pain to break him. You did not see him, Luvina. There was an emptiness in his eyes. I am sorry to hear that. Let us hope for the best. <laughs> yeah, we gotta check up on Sigurd in just a minute, just talking to we everybody. We could not have taken this fort without your archers, Hunwalde. My thanks. Oh, it was nothing, you know. All in a day's work. I may need call on them again one day. Ah, was this not the only... Right. Because I was hoping... Well, never mind. <laughs> you were hoping that I would be the last time? Beerston, your ram was invaluable in breaching this fortress. A trifle in comparison to the great service you have rendered me. You will have a good story to tell Alvida upon your return. There is that. But battle is not so thrilling and glamorous as the stories tell. I shall have to spruce it up a little. Uh, you mean a lie? <laughs> I have a couple more people to talk to. So, Mayalskona, it seems we have won. A great victory. Not even these walls could stand against us. This land will be ours in time. What now for you? Uba and I will go west, driving the Saxons before us. Alfred will not hold a crown much longer. I hope one day to see you both there. I would like that. Hold on, guys. Ooh. Every single time I'm doing recording, I always forget to turn my thing. phone down. What are you doing? Everybody wants to call to me. me. Enough goodbyes. Go to Sigurd. Yes. Be well, Uber. Everybody always wants to call me when I'm recording. I looked at my phone. I said, oh, <laughs> my phone's not on vibrate. That's unfortunate. So I went ahead and took care of that really quick. Okay, he's 5,000 meters away. So I need, I'm assuming that's meters or maybe that's miles. I'm so dumb. It was probably miles this whole time. Or maybe not. Freak. I don't know. I'm just going to fast travel over here. I'll look it up. I probably sound like a big old dummy. All right, but anywho. So the whole morning, uh... I haven't been able to pamper myself in like literally months and seeing how I had to postpone my wedding I was really sad about that so I'm like you know what I'm gonna go get my toes done so I got my toes done I uh, got my hands done I did my hair just totally indulging in self-love today guys and then I started watching this gameplay called at dead of night 
Markiplier and Game Theorist were playing it, but then they didn't finish. I know Markiplier broke his foot recently, so I was like, oh man, that sucks. So that's the reason why he hasn't been posting um, games as, you know, back to back as he normally does. What is going on here? The loading screens are kind of concerning me. Since when the PS5 has ever... No, the PS5 usually loads like a couple seconds. This is like PS4 issues, dude. I don't know, maybe it's because I'm getting close to the end of the game. I know when it comes to this game, um, there's always been issues and errors that I've experienced. Welcome, Bjorn. May you find a new home here among the Raven Clan. I hope to. And I will start now. They look like they're off and go say hi to Sigurd. That's nice of them. So yeah, I was doing that Good all boy. day. I know, mouse. I love mouse. Sigurd Jarl, back where you belong. Oh, I miss you, my brother. Yeah, you miss me? Yeah. Once or twice a year. What? It took you time to find me. Was it for this? To enjoy your time on my throne? Um... I did only what you asked of me. And you slew all those who questioned you. That is not what happened. Ranvi, Ranvi will tell you. Oh yeah, we'll see. My dear wife. Brought to me as a gift by her clan to pacify my ambition. Yes, I'm sure she will be the one to tell me the truth. What did that witch Fulke do to you? You cannot even begin to imagine the things I've seen. What I've learned. Born of gods is who I am. A lord of war. A Roman Mars. I know who I am. I know my destiny. And you will not hinder me! Um... Brother... Forgive me. I am faint. Tired of the day and all that has passed. I need air. He's been this way since his return. Could you speak with him? Settle his mind? I can try. I was just gonna say, didn't we just try to? Stand with cheer, one and all. Today is a day of celebration. Our Jarl is with us. Tonight, let us drink and Basim, will you not join us? In time, I may celebrate. But tonight is a melancholy mood. I would rather sit here quietly, alone, with my thoughts. I understand. Do not let Sigurd's present mood upset you. He spoke warmly of you as we sailed here. I believe he still trusts you more deeply than he can express. We trust each other. That is clear. Enjoy the feast, Eivor. Okay, I already talked to Randy. I don't know why she got a speech bubble on her. Where is Sigurd gone? Sigurd. Go, my eyes. Dang, he went far. That's kind of weird, though. I was not expecting her to tell Sigurd that he is the god of war. That's kind of strange, which is tear. It's even more stranger. I'm sure, I'm pretty sure he was this way. I think I just clicked it off wrong. What do you see? In the cemetery, his mood is dark. What are you doing here? I was looking for you. Sigurd. Dark died defending my honor? So he claimed. Then he was a fool. My honor needs no defense. It is stone solid. Unblemished. I offered him a way out. But... Shh. 
Say nothing more of the past, it is gone. There is a rift as deep as death between then and now. I was tested, Eivor, in a crucible of blood and fire. And in my agony, I was reborn. You may think me less than I was, but this is not so. I am greater than before. My mind is a wellspring of prophecies, visions that tell me who I truly am. And for all that, I am grateful for my suffering. Sigurd, I want to understand. But all this, all you say makes little sense. Basim saw these things in me. Fulke, too. Despite her cruelty, she spoke the truth. I am more than the man I was. More than this hobbling stick that stands before you. You must look harder, Eivor. Deeper. See for yourself what they found in me. Do you see it? My greater self. I... I don't know what that means. Look! This is the face of a god. I see only my brother and my truest friend. Return to where he is loved and cherished. Where he's meant to be. You are kind. But your eyes are clouded by the past. A place I can no longer see. I fear our paths diverged long ago. Go. I wish to be alone. Return to my feast and drink for me. Celebrate the days to come in my name. Best tell her the good news. Oh, what about the war? Alright, let's go talk to her then. Greetings! What happened yesterday? You and Sigurd disappeared during the feast, and when he returned, he went straight to our room without a word. We talked for a time. I asked many questions, but got few answers. I wish I could say more. Sigurd wants to blame me for every mishap that has befallen him, but gives me no credit for his rescue. I don't understand. Yet he does speak with you. With me, he has gone totally silent. So, what now? This is for Sussex. We burned it to the ground to save one man. Yet he's barely the man we were searching for. Quite so. Wait, is that a few more things on the freaking map? Excuse me. I thought I got all of them. Oh my gosh. I want to see the Alliance map. You gotta be joking me. What? Oh my god. Wowzer. Um... Okay. I guess I can do this one. What awaits in Jorvikshire? Halfdan Ragnarsson, conqueror of the north, sends his greeting. He wishes to meet with Eivor Wolfkist personally. Halfdan Jarl. I have heard that man's name so often, I feel as though I know him already. He is currently entangled in a war with the Picts of the Northern Hills. I suspect he wants your counsel, or your axe. If you are keen to meet him, he asks that you join him at his war camp. I have the location here. Um... I have changed my mind. Let I me should go. wait on that. Because... I need... 
Okay, that's Sigurd. There's no talking speech bubble there. That's him. Have you spoken with Sigurd lately? We talk from time to time. Why? Have you noticed any change in him? Any loss of, of happiness or feeling? He appears to me more thoughtful. Introspective. Thoughtful? That seems an understatement. He speaks as if he hears the voices of the gods whispering in his ear. We live in a strange time, Eivor. Among stranger people. Sigurd may be among the blessed. But who can say for certain? Indeed. Okay, so that didn't really give me too much answers. Um, let me do a, a face buff really quick. I feel like I'm really not going to get to the bottom of this until I continue on with the alliance. This will then give me more clues for the order. And maybe I'll find out more. Well, maybe the story with Sigurd um, will progress a little further. Because I can't speak with him. Beautiful, beautiful. Nature is amazing. Oh yeah, I forgot I took that thing out. Forgot I took that out too. I brought something for you. <laughs> I'm looking for this. Yeah, but everything else you need, I don't have. So, I need to be more mindful. A seal tail does not... Done. I must take my leave. So long. Oh, Say I hi remember. to Petra if you see her. Petra. Evil, how are you? I should go. Let's talk again soon. Okay. So I don't know. Let me look up my quest that I have so far. I can keep on doing the parades, which allows me to get more armor. I'll do that as like a side thing though, because I mean Again, this is just really just legendary armor. Or maybe I might make it an actual thing. I don't know. I'm not too sure. This one, I think Finwear is 280, I believe. And currently I'm 270, 274 actually, once I apply the skill points. So I'm technically prepared to go ahead and take that on. Uh, I don't really see anything else. I have taken down a lot of the Order members already. I feel like the story just really won't end until I get to the sea. My whole mindset during this game was that once I find Sigurd and I go to Vinland, supposedly Vinland is, I mean, if I remember correctly, I haven't been there in a while, you guys know. Um, but when we last spoke about Vinland, Vinland was supposedly the place where the person that killed Eivor's parents is. I want to so see I thought alive. that would be the end of the game, but clearly it isn't. What so, in your I'm just going to skip through this. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to pledge an allegiance to this area here. It'll be quick for me to take it out, because I mean, it's only power level 190. Yes, I will go proceed with caution. Okay, let's see how far away that is for me. Well, I already know how far away that is for me. That was kind of dumb. Uh, I do have a fast travel point here. I do. And there's also armor in this area. It's a 250. There might be a place where I can raid so I can get that really quick. I want to be able to do that. Might be really good armor. Now I know why there's a lot of people with like literally gold armor sets. They're probably just going straight for the river raid. So I'm definitely going to make the time to go ahead and do that. I might end up doing that off camera. Not too sure. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I'll go about doing that. Because I know you guys want to really see the main story and so do I. So that might be something I might do off camera. I think I think that'd be best because it's not really part of the story. What is going on with the loading screens? 
I feel like I just kind of have to restart my PS5 or something. It was running for a couple of hours without me doing anything with it, so maybe that's what I need to go ahead and do. Okay, so now I'm here. Yes, there is armor over here. I think it's on the other side of this. I'm just gonna go to it really quick. I mean, what's the worst that would happen, right? Pretty sure I can take care of whatever gets thrown at me. I love this bow, man. This will forever be my baby. Who saw me? What? I was gonna say, ain't no way. I can take out these people pretty quick. I play my cards, right? I know you guys want to see me progress through the story, and so do I. Oh crap. Did they all see me now? Pretty fast. There you go. Crap, I missed. Oh, freak. Well, I mean, that was bound to happen. I'll just get my arrows back, no big deal. There you go. Easy as pie. Let's go ahead and take what's mine. Mentor's mask, ooh. Cool beans. Right, let's go ahead and take a look at what's over here. See, I love it when it's not that hard to get what I want. There you go. It's like every single time I haven't been on the game in a minute, I do a lot better. Though. I've been kind of indecisive about the whole webcam thing. Because I mean, everybody's doing it. You guys already be seeing my face anyway if you guys watch my other videos. So I don't know. Oh, that's right. You know what? I could just get on my yeah. boat, right? Because it's literally on the other side of all this land. Yeah, it is. See? You see? <laughs> I mean, okay, so this is what I'll do. Let me hop off of Mr. Pomper here. I'm gonna call my boat. I just feel like it makes more sense. Hey! What's up, friends? See, this is why I like, you know, taking the time to be able to um 
you know, do side stuff and level up and get skill points and whatnot and get stronger because it makes everything so much easier in the long run. Like, if I wasn't as powerful as I am now, I wouldn't be able to take out those guys as quick as I did. Then, you know, you guys would be seeing me literally struggling the whole time. Like, I'm not going to sit here and say that I'm not good at playing games. I mean, obviously, you know, I'm pretty decent at playing games. I wouldn't even like playing games in the first place. I'd be getting too irritated even more playing them. But, I don't know. I like to be a completionist. Like, honestly, like, if I wasn't recording this gameplay, I would probably do all of these raids. Like, no lie. I would just make, like, a specific day when I would just completely take everything out. That's why I thought about doing Twitch. But at the same time, it's like, I feel like people are more interested in the actual story more than anything. Me? Like, I love watching people's gameplay and from YouTube and stuff like that. But if they just do inside stuff, I personally don't really like pay attention to what's happening. I might like go get get up and get a snack to eat or something like that. I don't real deal be paying attention. But when it's a story, I'd be sitting there glued on the TV. And I know not everybody's the same. Like, you know, I give people views. Like, even if I'm not actually watching it, I always sit there and just let it play just to give that person views. And that's old, how I've always been, even before I actually knew how YouTube even worked. But, like, I know some people are not like that. Like, if it's not interesting, I mean, y'all not going to watch it. And that's completely understandable. I mean, you're not going to sit here and waste, you know, 30 minutes of your time watching something that's not interesting to you. So, I try my best to give you guys content that's... So, wait a minute. Where am I going? <laughs> I just literally thought about that. Why am I going all the way around? I'm really confused. Am I going to the map marker? Oh my god, I totally am. What you mean destination can't be reached? You Oh my god. Alright. Wow, we finna turn all the way back around. This is crazy. Alright guys, um I'm gonna pause it here. Well, I'm not finna pause it here, but I'm not finna have you guys watch me literally take my boat all the way around here because by the time I get here the part will be over with. So just give me a minute. I'm finna get there guys. I felt like I was 
Alright guys, so we are here. That actually didn't take as long as I thought it would. Call my mount. Time to get jiggy with it. Alrighty, so we are a good minute from there. I think... Oh! Was that supposed to be an ambush? I see. Wait, if I take you out though, would that do something for me? Yeah. Probably not, but... Yeah. Did I do it? I did. I still got some piggies coming out for me though. Oh, yeah. dang it. Alright, Mr. Pomper, I gotta get off. These piggies ain't for the stop. That was just about everything, right? Dang! They took out all these people that was just minding their own business taking the trail. How rude. I think I took them out over here. Yeah, I did. Just getting my arrows back. Because those are important. Mr. Pomper, could you come back to my side, please? I would greatly appreciate it. <laughs> Thank you. Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and get this synchronizing point really quick before I actually continue on. Which should be right here, but it looks like this little bend over here will probably take me here straight to it. So I'm not going to off road it just yet. Especially because it takes away my stamina. <laughs> so rude. of battle. Ooh, it looks like it was serious. It's like serious black. Alright, let's get up here. Wait, who? Who's man? What? I don't understand. up here anyway even if they try to <laughs> oh here we go it's literally right here I was gonna say I'm like wait a minute I know it was close here we go Wait a minute. We ain't trying to come back up now. Alright, cool. Did that. I can climb down from here. Yeah, it's safe. There's more wolves? Where? Strange thought took all of them out. Anyway, Mr. Pomper, come to my side, please. Thank you. Alright, let's go ahead and look for this area. Okay. Yeah. Actually, looks like it's right above here. 
leading up the hill. Oh, so I guess regardless of how to get off of here. All right, no problem. Eivor is an Viking assassin. She can do it. Everyone all right. wounded and get every man's name. We leave none behind. Oh, well met, Eivor Ravenfren. Now there's a face I've seen before. Faravit. We met in Jorvik, the Yuletide feast. Oh, yeah. The Yuletide massacre. I remember. What brings you here? Halfdan Jarl. He summoned me. Is he near? He was, but the Picts hit us hard. We were separated. Oh, now I hear screaming. Fresh attack from the hills. Circle round! Watch your backs! Picts. They won't be happy to see the likes of me. Oh. Yeah, I was gonna say, let's get the... Get your guys out the way. No glory for you, man! Oh crap. Hold and take you all. No fellow. They're actually pretty tough. Okay, there we go. Whoa! Alright, well that took care of him. I don't have any more arrows, unfortunately, so that's the reason why I'm traveling over here to their side. guys were tough though. They had a lot more arsenal than what I'm used to. There you go. Are you wounded? I live. If we die today, tonight we drink with Odin. Either way, we claim victory! Once again. Halfdan Reknason, we meet in the Forge of Battle. Surely a good sign. I don't know you. 
One of Farrowit's new dogs? I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Eivor, yes. Down in Mercia. Kingmaker with my brothers Ivar and Uba and Finir in East Anglia. From the tales I hear, I feared you might be taller. That's not a fear you feel often, I imagine. So you answered my summons. <laughs> but the timing is poor, as you can see. Too many here are spent, battle sore. Thirsty. Faravid, have your men build field pyres for the dead. At once, my yard. Not here, not now. Then to Donna Caster for a victory feast! Uh oh. Looks like something fishy's going on. The oldest son of Ragnar Lothbrook, so he says. What do you make of him? A heroic display. He makes a powerful first impression. Just the way he likes it. Welcome to Jorvikshire, friend. Well met, Faravit. I was hoping your Jarl would be as welcoming, but I suppose I must earn his trust. Is that why you've come here? To earn Hafton's trust? To find a seat at his table? I have my own table. What I want is a bond of friendship between the new lords of England. Among whom you count yourself, I suppose. It is an ally I seek, not a master. Well, there is but one lord of Northumbria. All right, new arc started. The Saints of Halfton. All right, guys. So that is actually all the time that I have for this one. A little, a bit, a little over um, than I expected. I didn't think we were gonna hop right into it just like that with a battle, but I should have figured. But all right, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe so you guys are notified every single time I post a new video. And of course, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.